The problem majorly is that uh, you don't find ATMs every time uh, close by and uh, at least I don't find my ATM close by. So um, to withdraw money every now and then is uh, uh, it's like you can't put too much money because I have to withdraw every now and then and if I have to withdraw it from another bank the problem will be that they will reduct if you uh, go across three times if you withdraw. I've just started using ATM uh, cards for the past one month and for, uh, I had fears basically how I go about it, how the process is about. Um, the biggest difficulty I've had personally is that one is that I'm careless so I'm always uh, worried that I will forget my money or my card at the ATM. Uh, although one is um, access as in you, you never find ATMs all the time and when you do they don't have cash in them. Recently what problem we are facing? Safety is the major issue. Even in the city itself so many things happen. Uh, that is a major thing and absolutely physical securities are not there. That is major, especially night times. And that is a major uh, problem. Other, other than that, now counting number of usages is reduced now. That, you know, always we can't carry money everywhere. So that is the uh, beauty of cards, right? Now that also some limitations are there. So I have to carry card and cash both. At times, it doesn't work properly. So when you're shopping and it doesn't work, it creates a lot of trouble. The main system of uh, putting the card inside, that is a bit of a scary part because sometimes the cards are torn and it might go in and not come back. So that's a problem. Uh, at nights, like late nights when you go uh, like after like 9 o'clock or 12, uh, maybe like 10 o'clock, there will be no security officers in some of the ATMs. So I remember there's, there's a case where a lady was killed inside the uh, ATM counter. It's been a, a huge word case in Bangalore. So I think that's a bit of a problem. So there is no ramp, first of all, and there is no like uh, any sound or anything like that disabled people can understand and can use the uh, ATM machine. For example, a blind person, it would be really difficult to use the ATM, you know, but yeah, something like, you know, uh, catching up the voice and they say this is what they want. How, what is that? Account number, if they remember, because they are usually sharp, they remember the numbers, right? So something, you know, that kind of interaction with the machine, which may help them to get the cash. Then, uh, like maybe a person who is handicapped, who doesn't have leg or something, you know, he cannot stand, right? So what they have to do, they have to have somewhere like a su separate kind of machine or in the machine to be used by only disabled, you know, which will help them not to stress off their body or something like that. Actually, for uh, physically challenged people, there are provisions in the ATM, not all ATMs. Uh, most of the ATMs are having that, you know, earphone that uh, facility is there. But I tried uh, some of the ATMs. I don't want to mention that bank name and all, but uh, not working properly. For physically challenged people, that is challenging job only. That is uh, not user friendly. One is opening the door or um, even to uh, put the cards in and if sometimes it's not clear actually the screen of the ATM. Um, in terms of disabilities, uh, most of the ATMs I've seen are at a pretty higher uh, platform and uh, even the ramps they provide are pretty steep. I don't think a person in a wheelchair can do it by himself. And even if we get inside an ATM cabin, the screen is at a pretty high level, so I think even that is a difficulty. And if you're like uh, visually impaired also, I think most ATMs don't have a sound assistance. So I think that's another problem. Those ramps are really steep and I honestly don't see uh, anybody on, a, on their own being able to access those ATMs on those ramps because they're very steep and some they don't even make the effort but i do notice that last two months last two or three months they've been adding ramps uh, up in terms of um, visual uh, 
Accessibility, I think it's very difficult. I've noticed very few ATMs, they have uh, braille letters on the um, buttons, but not all ATMs do. And some of them are touch screen. So that makes it all the more difficult. But some ATMs do have, uh, uh, you have like a input for uh, headphones. But honestly, I'm not sure how easy it would be to actually find it. And on, not all ATMs have it. So you can't enter an ATM, you know, banking on the fact that those options are going to be there. You will be limited to only a few ATMs. And you just have to pray that there's going to be cash or the required amount of money in that ATM. So your options are limited. Again, I knew it's so the luck of the draw. Hey, I'm Krishna. Uh, I'm from ba Bangalore. Right now, I work at a social enterprise called Gift Table. Basically, I'm affected by uh, cerebral palsy. Uh, motor act activities of the body is like doesn't work properly because, and it's kind of stiff. You know, when I uh, got my first job, I needed to have a salary account, so I need. Uh, I went to open my bank uh, bank account. And luckily, I went with my friend. So when I went there, like there was like there was no accessible, accessible. The bank was not accessible. Uh, there were many steps there. So all I, like even I didn't have a wheelchair at that time. So my friend had to go there and do the, all the formalities. He got me the fo form. I filled the form outside, and he like he took it inside and like the, I opened my first bank account outside the, from outside. And later on I got my ATM card and uh, like when I go to ATM, none of the ATMs are accessible. Like every time I need to depend on my friends or my family like to get the money. Like I go till the ATM but I can't go inside because there are steps and none of the ATMs have ramps. Like every time I need to share my pin with my friends or somebody else like to withdraw money. Yeah, sometimes when I need money, like I go to uh, and uh, when I go to put petrol to my bike, I uh, I swipe more in the swipe machine and borrow money from the ATM guys. Sorry, uh, petrol uh, petrol guys. That I do that only because the ATMs are not accessible and I can't withdraw money on my own. RBI has uh, given the guidelines like 
all the banks and ATMs should be accessible but none of them are following those guidelines and the, none of them are still accessible we need to work on them it's not just about ramp or like uh, infrastructure even the atmosphere there and the people there should be disabled friendly like people should come forward to help us